by for dinner, maybe. Joss has worked up a hankering to come on. Hang on, we gotta go. Back to our chat. I'm Jillian Jordan. Welcome to the World Report on oh. 54 Haven't forgotten I exist after all. I had to sort some things out. Help my sis. Randy's still in the hospital. Someone has to keep an eye on the kids when Joss visits him. Relax. Don't need to explain. Right. So, you gonna stop by? How could I say no? Right, great. See you at Joss's then. Sounds pretty. Who is here? You sell the new or used threads? Used. Nobody's willing to ship any new stock all the way out here. But who am I to complain? You just have to tread the highway, peek into the wreckage. Sharp eye will always pick up something. Hmm? Looking for some decent outerwear. You're in luck. Our prices are out of this way.
Right. So, where was I? Ah, that was it. Nice weather today. Place got a name? Didn't see any sign. Salmonella. I'm sorry. Salmonella. Nice ring, no? My brother-in-law thought of it. Said it means salmon in Italian. Feeling kind of hungry. Okay. Patience is a virtue. Oh, hey! Hi! Glad you're here. I need your help cooking. What's on the menu? Jambalaya. Come on, you can stir the meat. Um, soy meat? Okay. Dunno, maybe Joss would be more help. Joss did her bit. Just grab the damn spoon and start stirring. This an ancient ward family secret? Onions, paprika, thyme. I just need to mince some celery and garlic. But you stir, please. Stir. <laughs> I'm stirring, I'm stirring. Bet my socks you've never had better jambalaya. Honestly, I thought you were kidding about the cook-off. Where the Joss had sweat away in the kitchen while... How? Joss doesn't know the first thing about cooking. Actually, I like to torture foodstuffs. <laughs> Haven't had many opportunities lately. How's, uh, Randy holding up? He's looking for his old self. Physically, though, it'll be a long road before he's back to full health. And, uh, mentally? That was some experience. What Harris did to him, fucked as this might sound, might have helped the kid. Could be wrong, but feels like a clean break for him. Don't mean to spoil a nice day, but I gotta ask, what about Peter Pan? You're asking if I killed him. We'll talk later, okay? All right. Think you've stirred enough? Mind grabbing the rice from the kitchen? Yes, sir. No, Randy's always been that way. But I'm sure this didn't help none. You know, his father was a difficult man, too. That's exactly what I told him. But he always got the same speech back. Nobody cares about these kids who don't exactly fit the mold. In those words, yeah. Wanted to tear my hair out every time I heard him. And when can I visit again? That's great, because I really want to bring him something. He loves music, so... Sorry. No, I'll remember. Just tell me. Thanks so, so much. You've been wonderful. Huge help. Mm-hmm. Yes. Talk again soon. Really nice of you to come. Looking good, Joss. Really think so? Thanks. Uh, thanks for having me over. I should be thanking you. How's Randy? Still in the hospital. Still in shock. But he's making progress. Haven't had a chance to tell you just how grateful I am. It was all River. I just helped. 
I just don't know how to repay you. If Randy had... Uh, don't owe me a thing, Joss. Thank you. Whoever's in the backyard, he couldn't wait to see you again. That's Maddie, nice. in next. Now you can toss in the rice. Rice is in. Okay, now this has to bubble and brew. Patio. Grab a chair and a beer or something else. It's nice out here. Yeah, seems all good. Like nothing bad ever happened. Tell me now about Harris. I paid him a visit at the hospital. He's still in a coma? Yep. In a strange slumber between life and death. An empty shell in a hospital bed. One shot to the head, quick and clean. I had the same thought. It would be so easy. I pressed the gun to his head and remembered something. River? How my parents died. Now, I'm sure you want to hear this. What happened? Old man had a farm, like Harris's dad. But when business took a turn, well... My parents managed to open a small grocery. We lived on the floor above. A loud noise woke us one night. They wanted cash. Register was empty, so they stormed upstairs, forced us all to kneel and demanded my dad tell him where he hid the money. Mostly, I remember my ma crying. My dad swore they'd found all we had. One was gassed out of his mind. He fired first, blew half my dad's skull off. Jesus, River, I'm sorry. He was erratic, went rabid, handed me his gun and ordered me to aim it at my mom's head. I can still see her tear-filled eyes at the end of that barrel to this day. What did you do? Nothing. I stood frozen. Finally, he just snatched the gun back, shot my mother, and they left. Police never caught him. That was why I joined the force. I couldn't agree with scum like that roaming free. No one to hunt him. Was Joss there too? Saw all this? Mm hmm. I think when she looks at me, she still sees that boy holding a gun to her ma's head. Can't tell you how sorry I am. So when I stood over Harris in that hospital bed, barrel to his brow, I was that kid again. But I was also the junkie who shot my parents. I understand. I've ended a few lives in my time, but never like that. Never an execution. Slipped out of the hospital quick told myself the case was closed. That's good. But what now? You're not 
going back to the PD. PI has a nice ring to it. Who knows? Uncle we'll River, see. you said you'd play with us. You promised. All right, all right. Let's go. Me? Join us? What are we gonna play, Uncle River? You'll see. Dorian, we're playing! Yeah, big trouble in Haywood. Grab your set. Always wanted to try a game like this. Well, well. Nice firepower there. This is no time to get distracted. We can't let that filth get away. Who? Oh, well, look at you. V, allow me to introduce Captain Joan McLean and Lieutenant Henry Callahan. And they're our precinct's best and brightest. Wouldn't want to get in their way. I always work alone. No exceptions. Even for you. Yeah, me too. Ooh, I've heard of cops like you. The lone wolf type. That's right. Thorns in their commander's side. Rebels who play by their own rules. I've been suspended one time, retired two times, and kicked off the force three times. I'm getting too old for this. But something always drags you back. The city needs me. Got a crash course? Anything I ought to know? The entire city is sick with crime and corruption. Lawlessness rules the streets. And we're no saints either. Even the police are haunted by the sins of their past. But the city's without hope. No one else would ever dare face El Chamuco and Diablad. Oh, he's the worst, but I know we can beat him. All right, let's get to it. All right, all we gotta do is track down El Chamuco and... He'll pay for his crimes. We'll play like two teams, us and the kids, but we work toward the same objective. The team with the best result wins. You don't stand a chance. Evie, just go easy, okay? It's their favorite game. Sure. Oh, there he is! Get him! The city's mine! You'll never take her from me! <laughs> She's fast, but not fast enough to escape justice. Watch out! It's cruel! Hey, I have better Oh, you aid. got... Nuh-uh! Watch this! Next round! Next round! This way. It must be their rat-infested hideouts. I could smell the moral decay from a mile off. Quiet. Too quiet. It's a trap! They were waiting for us! Not 
half bad. Okay, I think we got them all. But it's not over yet. Some last words? Fine. Out with it, scumbag. I want to see you squirm. No! Your last words! <laughs> oh, come on. Another ambush? Okay, so now... Lunch is ready. Uh... Oh, Mom! You almost had him. Oh, you'll get him next time. At least we beat the grown-ups. for letting them win. They had fun. Ah, they're great kids. It's no problem. Seems they took a liking to you, too. Hey, food's on the table. So, was your game fun? Awesome! <laughs> we kicked their big butts! The bad guys? Huh? Oh, yeah, the bad guys, too. Time to see if this tastes as good as it smells. Unemployment's being good to you. You seem good. River's discovering the joys of family life. That and police duty. Never a good mix. This here's a way to get some of those years back. I haven't seen him this... untroubled in a while. What about you, V? You got a family? Or just relations? Used to see family as baggage, something that'd hold me back, you know, career first. Didn't do any better for not having one, though. Nothing's more important to me than my kids. I've made mistakes, life's gone off the rails sometimes, but I had my kids. I got my kids. Speaking of, it'd be great if Randy was here. Won't be long. Randy loves Jambalaya. Joss, you see me being a parent ever? I mean, I don't exactly look like good palm material myself, so... Yes! Who says yes? I do. <laughs> he raised his hand himself! <laughs> v, are you seeing someone? Involved? Fess up, please. Um... Well, that's decided. <laughs> Got an 11.99. Officer needs backup. Come on, pull you out of this ambush. Thanks, Joss. Yeah, thanks. Whew, situation was getting dicey. That's what partners are for. You were about a hair's breadth away from having to look at photo albums. Here we are. What are we looking at? A water tower. Great spot. Great for what? Having a drink? Shooting the shit. This way, oh, fuck. Gate stuck again. Gotta fix it one of these days. Let me give you a boost. Climb over, open it from the other side. Yeah, okay. Good. Just push. Uh, seems easier to open from that side. Ugh. Okay. On our way. Area's not bad, actually. Unlikely to dazzle. Make a good first impression, though. Certainly no Corpo Plaza. No. But life's livable here. No worse places to raise kids. Randy's problems with the law. Those didn't pop out of thin air. True, but Randy takes after his old man. He'd find trouble in a nicer neighborhood, too. Up 
Apparently the worst oh. city between the Atlantic and the Pacific. But I sure do love this view. Find it calming. Scrapers actually seem pretty majestic out here. Not seeing what goes on inside. Memories? High stress, dirty backstabs, kind of pressure that gives you ulcers. Somehow, I just don't miss it. Got something for you. <laughs> Your piece? Had her a long time. Too long. I think it's time she found a new owner. To know what to say. Just promise you won't blow your foot off. Oddly specific request. Josh's husband did it. Drunk. This very spot. Which made this your special spot. Family landmark? Something of the kind. Now for the highlight of the evening. Up for a drink? Something strong is sure to hit the spot. Now that I understand. To friendship. To friendship. You got any more of that? Two bottles of whiskey and a case of beer ought to be enough. <laughs> we'll see about that. Buckle your liver in. It's gonna be a long night and a longer morning. <laughs> See you next time.